So in order to run RenderMan for Maya, we need to make sure that the plugin is installed. If you have downloaded the free non-commercial license for RenderMan, go ahead and install it. And then when you launch Maya, you want to make sure that the plugin is installed. In order to do that, we're going to go to Windows and Settings and Preferences. And right at the bottom in the Plugin Manager, we are going to go towards the bottom and you will see a plugin called RenderMan for Maya dot bundle. Make sure that it's loaded and auto load. That's the first step. Then you will notice that you get a RenderMan shelf right here. You will also get a RenderMan menu at the very, very top. If you want to check the version of RenderMan that you're using, go to about RenderMan for Maya and it will tell you that this is version 20.9. And the third place we're going to check is the Hypershade. We can go to the Hypershade by clicking on this icon right here or going to Windows, Rendering Editors, Hypershade. When we launch the Hypershade under the Create window, you will notice that we have RenderMan Radius and RenderMan RIS. This is where we are going to create specific shaders that we will use with the RenderMan. Same thing for lights. And this is how you load RenderMan for Maya.